This video will show you how to support your child when using the partition and recombine strategy to add and subtract larger numbers. First, take two two-digit numbers. For example, 23 add 34. Make sure the children know the value of each of the digits. Tens, units, tens, units. The numbers should be partitioned into tens and units to make the calculation more manageable. For example, 20 add 30 equals 50. Then take the units. 3 add 4 equals 7. Then recombine by taking the two answers and adding them together. 50 add 7 equals 57. When using three digit numbers, we need to be more careful. 142 add 124. Remember, hundreds, tens, units hundreds, tens, units. 100 add 100 equals 200. <coughs> 40 add 20 equals 60. 2 add 4 equals 6. Be careful when completing the final calculation as the place value of the numbers can be quite confusing. 200 add 60 add 6 hundreds, tens, units, tens, units and units equals 266 hundreds, tens, units. We can use the same method when subtracting two and three digit numbers. For example, 76, take away 34, tens, units, tens, units, equals 70, take away 30, which equals 40, 6, take away 4, equals 2. The children need to make sure that they use the correct calculation at this point and remember to add the two numbers even though they are subtracting. 40 add 2 equals 42.